The body of a young Marine from Tracy is back home tonight as the community gathers to celebrate his life and honor his service to our country. I want to show my support for the troops that are fighting it for our country and the ones that die, especially young, it just touches my heart. City leaders, first responders, and veterans were among the groups paying tribute in a special motorcade down Schulte Road and Central Avenue in Tracy today. CBS 13's Carlos Correa is live at the Fry Funeral Home where the family has gathered. Carlos? Yeah, it was a special symbol of unity tonight as strangers in and out of the community came together to honor this hometown hero. Men, women, and children in Tracy are proudly waving their American flags as they gather to honor a young Marine. It shows that people care. You know, it shows that people are behind their veterans. It shows that people are behind the military. Lance Corporal Lenin Priego Zurita was a member of the United States Marine Corps and until recently a proud member of the Tracy community. The Marine Corps is very strict and they're very, you know, they're very strict about their ways. So to become a part of the elite, it's not, e it's not easy, you know. And for him to be robbed of that, um, it's tough. It's really tough. Priego Zorita died July 30th, three weeks after his birthday. According to a friend of the family, the young Marine was found dead in his barracks with no other information being released. Everybody's kind of like, you know, what happened? You know, they just randomly found him. It's, it's a tragedy. Nobody ever likes to see that, especially with the Marines. The 20 year old Marine was a 2015 graduate of West High and is now being honored for his bravery and service to our country. It seems so small in the, in the face of the sacrifice they give. Uh, but at the same time, it offers us a reminder of, of just what's going on. The body of the hometown hero arrived in Tracy Thursday, surrounded by friends and family and several members of this small town community who came out to show support for a life lost too soon. I want to show my support for the troops that are fighting it for our country and the ones that die, especially young, it just touches my heart. Now, visitation for this young Marine is planned for Sunday with math services and military honors scheduled for Monday at Veterans Park. And actually, we're going to be talking to the young Marine, uh, the young Marine's parents in just a few minutes, and we'll bring that to you later tonight. Back to you. We'll give them our best and tell them we're uh, in their prayers, no doubt. Thank you so much, Carlos. We'll see you soon.